sama Pak Jasman, Pak Jasman kirim sama aku. Ah, oh, oh, di videonya. <coughs> Alhamdulillah. Yang terlambat tadi Pak apa? Asmardi. Pak Asmar, kalau apa? Pak Wang Asri. Pak Wang Kepala SD dulu kan? Iya. Sekarang kamu pengawas? Nah, pensiun. Oh, sama. Ya. Pangkat, pangkat tertinggi. Asklas kota berguna. Ilah, isi seluruh ya. Assalamualaikum. Ya, lalu selesai mengadakan pertemuan silaturahmi bersama Jasman Jaiman dengan Aswir Astaman. Uh, Mudah-mudahan uh, silaturahmi ini berjalan terus. Walaupun waktunya tidak ditetapkan, yang penting setiap bulan memang ada kegiatan selektorah ini. Demikian, terima kasih. M. Rakib Jamari dari Pekanbaru, Riau, Indonesia. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Saya sekarang berada di Jalan Sudirman. Ini suasananya ramai, tengah hari. Jam 12 di Jalan Sudirman, Pekanbaru, Riau, Indonesia. Panen bang, telepon saya dan masih banyak lagi. Ya, apa? Ya, sekarang saya memasuki mobil. Oh, itu ada lubang ya? Bisa, bisa. bisa ya? Ya. Ambil lu, kau berpaya lah Iya Ya, ini Jalan Sudirman, Pasar Pusat, bukan baru. Ya, keadaannya. Ya, nah, di tengah hari, wah panas, tubuhku berkeringat. Ya. Terus Jalan Sudirman Ujung Ya Ini ada bus Kota
niat baik ini al Mission ini buat stuck in Arab Sheikh. Yeah. Bain and Bain out. Reaching to him. And you're wasting your time, ya Pray and and you straight jacket your life. You don't drink, you don't gamble, you don't eat the pig and on and on. Allah is not hungry for that. You want salvation? You believe that he sent his son into the world and he died for your sins and salvation is yours. God Almighty, he came down to earth and he died for your sins. Believe and be saved. And he won't let go. Every day he's there. Every day he's there. He's making life miserable. Miserable. For this poor Arab Sheikh. How is he to get out of the difficulty? So he plans a strategy. He tells his, his prime minister, his wazir, He said, look man, tomorrow when he comes, I want you to whisper something in my ears. Okay. So hey. Yes, that's all. And the missionary came. Assalamu alaikum. So the Arab, as usual, ahlan wa sahlan. Beautiful words of welcome. The most beautiful words of welcome in any language. Ahlan wa sahlan. Just think that you are a member of the family and sahl be at ease. If you want to pick your nose, you may do so. Like in the a standard ease. Now you can do what you like. Ahlan wa sahlan. And he starts the same old story. Alhamdulillah. So the, the, the minister comes along and whispers something in the races, in the chief's ears. And the chief begins began to cry. Like a woman who has lost her husband. He, he started to cry. <laughs> so the priest wants to know what's wrong? What has happened? He said, don't talk. So come on, come on, please. Tell us, you know, we may sympathize with him. <laughs> you can't. He's crying, crying. Acting, actually, exactly. So the priest is more eager to know what has happened, what's the sad news. So he said, you know, I just got the sad news. The Dakhi Jibreel, Jibreel al Islam. The Archangel Gabriel, he died. Mamat, Marge, Jibreel al Islam, Marge. So the priest says, you fool, the angels don't die. So the Arab Sheikh says, and you fool, you telling me that God died? Now, I believe that we have some questions from the brother's mic on the left-hand side. Go ahead. Hello, Dr. Zachary Naik. My name is Harris, I'm from Phoenix, Arizona, in the United States. I'm an entrepreneur and a marketing manager. Two of my friends in America have converted uh, watching YouTube videos of you. Uh, one of them a Christian, one of them an atheist. One of my friends um, presented me with how to deal with an atheist DVD of yours, which I did watch. Uh, but that didn't answer my question. And I've asked this question to a lot of people with no satisfactory answers, a lot of intelligent people. Of all the scholars that I've ever watched on YouTube, in my opinion, you are the most rational, logical, easy to understand kind of scholar that I've ever come across in my life. And it is really important that this question is answered because I've never had a satisfactory answer for this question. Uh, my question is like a coin with two sides. The first side of it is this, and this is the question. I'm somewhere between an atheist and agnostic. I'm not sure where. Um, God has created this entire universe. The Quran speaks a lot about how it has taken so many days and mountains and this and that and life is going to be a test and whatnot. My question is, way before God decided to create this entire universe, before he decided to put human beings, before he decided to send Prophet Muhammad or Adam and Eve, way before he even... Yeah.
แล้วก็อ่าอ๋อจำสุดาอัสรกันอัยสัลลัลเออเอาไปเนี่ยอ๋อเนี่ยอ๋อเนี่ยเลยอ่ะโอเคเออโอเคสบายอะไรก็ได้